it's Kevin Abstract once again, and it looks like time is just going really fast because we are about to be in the third and final installment of Arizona Baby. That's right, the last three, I'm assuming three, songs are going to be released, and we got started today with Peach, one day before the actual entire album is in its entirety released. So, this song is called Peach, and it features Joba, Bareface, and newcomer Dominic Fike. Now, I don't know if he's gonna become like an official Brockhampton member. I think more of this is kind of someone that Brockhampton likes, like Kevin Abstract specifically has been very, uh, very effusive in his praise of Dominic Fike. And I did listen to the uh, little EP he had, and I like Three Nights. The other songs were kind of hit or miss, but Dominic Fike is an interesting new character within this uh, Brockhampton realm. So it will be cool to see if maybe they um, put him in anything else. Now his role here is he serves as not only the chorus, but he actually has an intro verse in which he kind of talks about this girl that he's involved with, but it's not necessarily a, you know, deep relationship. It doesn't really have much length to it. And they're not someone, they're not someone that Dominic finds himself, you know, pining for or having you know, someone wanting to be around them for very long periods of time. But the the important line that he has is kind of saying, like, basically, you know, we wouldn't really, I don't see you as a year type of thing. It's more a short term type of thing. And though it is a little bit contrasted by the chorus, which kind of talks more about sort of in this um, sense of being a bodyguard, being like someone you love. It's kind of like, I'm there if you need me type of sensibility to it. This is kind of furthered by Kevin talking about this person who he was in a previous relationship in, I want to say. And he basically kind of says like, there were parts of our relationship where you kind of didn't do the best things for me. We did have special moments, but overall it felt as though you were not giving me the ability to grow as a person. So he kind of is looking back on this person, but he's not doing it in a negative way. Like, you know, he's not really saying this to demean them or anything because he even like, again, the chorus really pushes, pushes this idea that he's still there for that person and that person means something to them. And he even like kind of talks about the fact that they were both kids at the time, you know, saying that we were both like, you were just a baby, baby. <laughs> And it's an interesting thing to point out, but it also does display the maturity that Kevin has like grown into. Like you, it, it just happens when you get older. You start to like realize that like not everything is so intensely, you know, black and white as far as certain situations go. Like not everyone's just pure evil. There's always nuance to people and there's a gray area. And the real thing that I, I really, sweet thing that I enjoy about the song, not only is Joba's and Airface's additions to the song with a sort of a hook that they both sing in there. I really like, I really enjoy like every part of this song. I really like the, uh, the guitar that's involved here. It's kind of got this little sweet homegrown, almost acoustic vibe to it that really does enthrall me within this song. And also what's even more engaging is kind of this just very, again, this like hometown feeling sort of like looking back positively on a memory that you want ha once had that's the sonic characteristic i could really attribute to the song is it really does have that but it also has kind of this uh this very optimistic vibe but it, it sort of does feel like it's shelled within a memory that's kind of just being like looked back on like man these were some good times and now i want to have better times which is furthered by again kevin kind of talking about like i'm not a, i want to get a promotion i i'm not here for no bullshit like i'm trying to like i'm doing the things to be better and again it really harps on this kind of theme of like teach me this teach me that and sort of this is sort of kevin learning you know how to look back positively on something that might have played him at one point because when you're younger in um in a relationship and something bad happens and that relationship gets ended you kind of might initially look upon that relationship like oh this was just horrible instead of like being like there were some good moments in here coloring everything in black and white metaphorically is a dangerous thing to do and it's easy to learn like the nuances once you get older so overall this is, feels like a really sweet nostalgic song and i am very excited to see the next two songs or four or five how many you want to drop you please i am enjoying the kevin abstract so i am excited for that album which is coming out tomorrow and it's gonna be great kevin abstract Arizona. Thank you.
Let's see if he is. It's half. I don't think he named his half. Well, this guy says, never had peach. Even peaches, we kind of just, we just kind of never cross paths. However, I have crossed paths with many pears, many apples, a banana recently. Um, but I will forever be tied to strawberries. I'm lying. This is strawberry syrup. Come on now. Come on now. I'm a very healthy person. Come on.